everyone welcome to another episode of model car memories uh, this one's going to be over a couple different videos uh, depending upon how long it takes me to complete this uh, so I have had here an AMT 3-in-1 kit from 1961 uh, it's the Buick hardtop model uh, number K521 so it's going to take a while on this one this one's a uh, a partial. Uh, my stepdad had started work on this. So I've got the body. It uh, looks like he actually sprayed this one instead of uh, um, instead of brushing it, brushing it like a lot of the others. Um, but we got the hood already. And neat about this, it's got a little piece of chrome sticking up here. It's stuck through on the other side. So I thought that was kind of neat. Um, started on the interior a little bit um, looks like I tried to do a two-tone there or something like that but it's not not done so then uh, the engine uh, there's a couple parts on it that need to be finished up on the paint on the engine there that right there is a little little wobbly um, bottom of the chassis all except for a couple you know a couple things here are done um, we got a decal sheet that hasn't been touched let's see but I think a lot of the parts are already here um, some of them I'll just have to try to figure out what to go to so there's the uh, steering column got the chrome trees here we got the uh, spotlights and the side view mirrors, a couple of custom things. Let's see the aerials there, gear shift on it. And then there's some more customizing thing for uh, fins on the back or fender skirts. The, the glass looks like it's in really good shape. There's uh, nothing wrong with it there another piece of I think I saw the other one here for wherever that goes it might be for the custom headlights uh, it does have a thing for a continental kit on there um, I don't think I'm gonna put the continental kit on it um, got the dash so the dash needs painting as well Let's see there's the firewall looks like it needs cleaning up a little bit the uh, the tires did lean up against some stuff Okay, and there's the rear bumper there. Let's see, I'm gonna just dump the rest of this out here. Okay. So there's the front. We got our we got our tires here. Uh, looks like he tried to paint the white walls on it, so I might want I might have to touch those up. Um, lights here rear lights I'll have to last thing I can't find the instructions for this particular model um, I found these bumpers they really look like they go with something else uh, the way too small for this one maybe to go for that that triumph or something like that they might go with that um, some other some some moon caps another stock wheel cover so I got uh, so I got three axles here. Oh, maybe two axles. This axle is a lot smaller. So there's two of them there, and the steering wheel. So uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to paint as much as I can, uh, figure out where everything goes, and then uh, I'll just keep uh, doing update videos on this one, real short videos. So this will be a, a whole series here on this one, similar to the 57 Chevy. Uh, that one took about three videos for me to go through. Uh, it was more complete. Uh, this one has a lot more work to do to it. So, so stick with me. I'll try to put these videos out as soon as possible. I'll just, you know, paint them up and then uh, come back to you and show you the progress of them. But uh, thanks for watching. Uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And hit the notifier there so you'll know uh, when a new new video comes out. Uh, and then I'll 
try to put stuff on the Instagram page as well. Uh, so you'll probably see an update quicker on Instagram than you will see a video. So other than that, thanks for watching.